Hello, dear student of class two. Today, again we are going to start multiplication, but the different one from last yesterday we did. Understood? So, what we did yesterday? We did simple multiplication, just simple one. But today we are going to do regrouping of ones and x. You know what I mean? So today we are going to do multiplication with regrouping of ones and tens. It's very simple. So I want to repeat yesterday's talk once. Understood? So yesterday what we did? The simple, simple one is that. So that was one and ten. Understood? And the question was two, four. Multiply by two. Clear? So yesterday's work, I am just repeating to you for you to revise. Understood? So that might be how we did. We did two into four. How much? Eight. Very simple. And now two to the four. So in one's place it became eight, and in ten's place it became four. It means forty. Eight. Four tens. 14 means 40 plus 8 ones. Okay. Is equal to how much it became? 48. Understood? So this is the work that we did yesterday. So today, we took a different one that is regrouping. Either we can say that we have to keep carry over and do the sum. Understood? And first thing, every day I used to tell that we have to concentrate on multiplication table every day please keep in mind that every day whenever you get the time you must learn multiplication table understand because when we want to do multiplication division we need the table so if we know the table properly then we can do any type of multiplication or division that we do in our next classes understood so Multiplication with regrouping of ones and tens. Understood? So for that, here is the work that we do. Yesterday, what we did? Ones, tens. O means ones, T means tens. Understood? But today we are going to, we are going to do add H. Means Hundred. So, ones, tens, hundred. Understood? So look here. Yesterday what we did? We did ones and tens. Understood? The simple multiplication. But today we are going to do a regrouping. It means one, ten, hundred. So obviously, what you do today will make a hundred. Understood? So let's start the work. Please look here carefully. I am writing here. You know what is my H? 100 T tens O ones. Understood? Ones tens 100. So, always whenever we start doing our work, mathematics, addition, subtraction, multiplication, these three things we have to start from the ones place. That is from the last digit. Understood? So, today, we are going to do. here is 3 4 how much it became 34 understood so 34 we have to multiply by 3 yesterday at last as an example i shown one work for the same as understood so this is for removing or we can use as carry over. Understood? So, first thing, again I am coming to the same point that we have to recite the multiplication table very carefully. Understood? Very carefully. So, we have to multiply 34 by 3. Clear? 34. 4 ones, 3 days. 3 0, 30, 4 means 1. So, 34. So we have to multiply 34 by 3. 
So, first thing, we will come to the table. Understood? Three zero is the three. Three one is the three. Three two is the six. Three three is the nine. Three four is the twelve. Three five is the fifteen. So on. Understood? Now first, I am coming to the particular case. Now three four times. It means three four times means three first one time. Three two times. Three three times and three four times. It means three four is how much? Twelve. Understood? So two numbers came here. It means one tens. Understood? One tens and two one. Clear? So twelve. How much I got the answer? Twelve. So we cannot write this one. This is wrong. You know why? That is why. Regrouping. We have mentioned that regrouping. We have to make a group. Understood? So this is wrong. So now how we do the correct one? One to two. It means what we do as a carryover in tens place. One is ten. Is it? In ten place, one I write as a carryover. Understood? What I did? One. So out of twelve. Understood? Three four is how much? Twelve. So out of twelve, one is ten. So I get one in tens place. So now two is remaining. Two remaining. Understood? Now this I have to write in one space. Understood? The concept? Three four is twelve. Understood? So out of twelve, or both the number I cannot write in same place. So, what we have to do? We have to make carry over. It means in the place of tens, above of this number three, one, right, and make a circle. That will indicate us. Understood? Simple. I got the two here. So I'm writing it now. Next thing, and the most important thing. Now we will go for the tens. Okay. How many tens are there? Three tens. Understood? So three, three times. We have to multiply. Understood? So three, three is how much? Two. How much? Three is a simple nine. So nine. So what is the answer here? Nine. Is it correct? No. Wrong. Why? Because nine is three, three is a how much? Is nine. So I forgot to add two part. Clear? So. Now my answer is wrong. So let me make it correct. So three three are nine. This one I got the answer. Understood? Now what I do? I have to bring this and add with nine. So can you tell nine plus one how much it will become? Simple ten. Understood? Now here I have just written only last digit number, but here I have to write both this both number. That is ten. Understood? So I got the answer one zero. So how why we writing here all the number? This all this is because there is no number to make a carrier. Understood? This is our last number, so we cannot make carrier here. So all together the number that we get, we have to write here. Clear? Understood? So let's move for the next. Example. So please be carefully. Next one. Seventy three multiplied by six. Understood. Three in one space. Seven in ten place. There is no answer. But we have to mention answer because what we are doing? We are regrouping the number. Understood. So the last. I am going to show you example and through this you have to do your exercise very carefully. Understood? So now again the table same thing. Six zero zero zero. Six one zero six. Six two zero twelve. Six three zero eighteen. Six four zero twenty four. Six five zero thirty. Six six zero thirty six. Six 
Stay safe, stay home. Understood? 